Hello everybody, it's Lady Kayla here and welcome to the Geekdom. Um, my room is a complete mess. Um, when I finish attempting to clean my room, I might get back to doing some regular videos, which I'm hoping to do, especially since I plan to cancel Loot Crate. I need to do other videos. Um, but anyways, this is going to be my last Loot Crate. I guess it's kind of like my Christmas present to myself. Um, I'm all dressed up. This is what I wore to my family Christmas event. Isn't it such a pretty dress? Anyway, um, that being said, this might be the last Loot Crate, but trying to unsubscribe from Loot Crate is stupid because I, like, you know, it says you can unsubscribe anytime, and so I figured when I was subscribing that I could just click, the, like, a unsubscribe button and then they would process it, but now you have to, like, send them an email and, um, I still haven't, um, done that because, um, I thought I had sent them the email that I was supposed to send them, but I was wrong and I forgot to add some information, so I need to do that again. But isn't that weird? Like, you can't just hit an unsubscribe button, but whatever. <coughs> Here's December's Loot Crate. I'm also kind of sick, so it's just, we got the whole winter get up. We got me being sick, we got me dressed up for Christmas, and we got Loot Crate and my present to myself, I guess. So... Um, we're going to open this up. Hopefully this is good since it's going to be hopefully my last one. Hopefully I can get them to cancel it before they charge me for another one. Um, let's see. I don't know. I, I get excited anyway. <laughs> um, how should I do this? Should I do it just by pulling stuff out or should I do it from the booklet? I'm just going to pull things out this time. Let's just go with that. I got a candy cane and you know what? My friend put a candy cane in my tea. I think it was black tea and tasted so good. So that's what I'm going to use this candy cane for. Um, we have our Loot Crate December 2014 anniversary. Speaking of anniversaries, I've been on YouTube for four years now, and that's this December. <laughs> four years. That's awesome. So, um, next, we have socks. They're Guardian, Guardians of the Galaxy socks. I still haven't watched that movie. I hear it's really good, and I think I'd like it if I did watch it, but I haven't. And they are I Am Groot socks. And they have the little tiny baby Groot that everyone lost their shit over. And um, it says shoe size about 6 through 12. I have kind of thicker calves and I hate buying socks like this because my calves, I don't know where this would fit along my lot, like leg, but they're thick. They're not this thin like... They're not this thin, so when I wear socks, they kind of distort and do, you know, weird things. So I'm hoping when Groot stretches out, it doesn't look that weird, because I uh, bought TARDIS socks, and the TARDIS is supposed to be a square, so when it goes over your calf, it stretches out to not a square, so <laughs> it looks wrong. So I don't know, I have to try those on. Um... <coughs> Already, this is like a cool item. It's, you know, you get to wear it. Um, geeky socks kind of are on the pricier side. It's so expensive to be a geek, to be honest. Like, it it sucks. Um, next, I'm just going to go after this, the bigger stuff, I guess. There is the Pop Heroes um, collector's item, and it's the Joker Batman Batman. <laughs> um, so, it's Batman, but, like, Joker-themed. I don't know if this is from a specific artist, or if it's from a specific, I don't know, thing. I don't know <laughs> where it's from. I don't know if somebody just came up with the concept. But it's a Loot Crate exclusive. I'd have to look it up in the little booklet later, maybe. Um, 
And then these, I, I think these run pretty, pretty pricey. These are very collectible. They're like the popular thing to do now. I'm pretty sure because they're so popular and like people buy a bunch of them, there's, there may be, they might not be that like collectible, but um, I know since it's a Loot Crate exclusive, these ones might be a little bit more collectible than the rest um, because you can't just go in the store and buy them. Anyways, next is a, or, and let me show you a little bit more up close because I feel like I just pull things out and I don't even show you what it is. So, yeah, kind of creepy. Mine kind of looks like it's been opened or something, like, the box kind of just loosely comes undone, whatever. Um, next is Tetris sticker set. The possibilities are endless. 147 stickers and design booklet? I don't, I don't understand. So, it comes with patterns and stuff. Just in case you don't know what to do with the stickers, it tells you what kind of cool stuff you can do with your stickers. And I don't know how hardcore these stickers are, like... I don't know, like, if they stick on, like, super well, or if they're just stickers, or, like, what kind of crafts you can use them for, but, you know, they're showing you, like, putting them on bags and on your laptops and stuff, so I'm guessing these stickers must be pretty hardcore and must stay on very well. Um, so that's really awesome. I feel like I've already got my money's worth from this loot crate already, so let's see what else. Here's the booklet that I was looking for that I couldn't find. Um, next is an Avengers air freshener in vanilla. So that's awesome. It's Captain America. <laughs> I've never been a fan of Captain America, but I'm sure I know friends who are. Um, next is I'm going to... It's The Simpsons. I can see that. I just... It's a wallet! It's a paper wallet! I thought it was a poster. I was about to unfold it and be like, oh, it's a poster with all the... But it has, like, all the characters in it, and it's just, it's made out of this, like, sturdy paper. I, at least I'm hoping it's sturdy, but it feels pretty rad. And it has multiple pockets. I have... I have wallets that are not as pocketed as this is. Alright, so it's a mighty wallet. Apparently it's strong and resistant to tears and stays. Doesn't say water though. So I'm not sure. <laughs> Because it feels like paper. <laughs> so I'm just like, I want it to be a little waterproof, maybe. <laughs> but so far, it doesn't really seem it. it has too many pockets, two credit card pockets, and two business card pockets. I don't know if the credit card pockets and the business card pockets are the same pockets, though. Because all I see are these little pockets for, like, cards. I'm not, sh I'm not certain. Um... Oh, you can get 10% off at a certain website if you go before a certain time and use the code. Um, you can customize your own wallets, but I'm guessing this is the website that you can do it. Oh, I just got a bunch of coupons for the website where you can buy these wallets, but I don't think I'll be buying any wallets. Um, <laughs> I have like a million. But this is awesome. Um, I've heard of these. I've seen them before. I've never actually got to hold one, but I've seen them like online and stuff. And so that's awesome. I kind of like it because it doesn't look like a wallet. So you kind of like have it laying around and like no one would really know what it is. So it might be like theft resistant. <laughs> But anyways, that's enough about the wallet. I, I go on tangents. You guys should know me by now.
if not pi. Um, and then usually on the bottom are all these uh, like free trials and sometimes a free like um, online comic. Um, Here's a Ghostbusters thing. I use a keymaster. And then it says, back off, man. I'm a scientist. Which I'm not. But, yeah. I don't like science. I mean, I don't not like science. There's a lot about science that I really enjoy, that I'm really into. But, I don't know, I'm not good at science, like, as a subject, like a school subject, <laughs> if that makes any sense. And then, there is this Batman comic, guessing. I also, I don't, I don't do comics. The only thing that I've bought was the graphic novels, um, the Sandman graphic novels, and I love those, but I just, I can't really do comics because they're so small and short, and I like, I like novels. I'm a novel person, and, um, so yeah, I usually avoid comics. The reason I got the Sandman graphic novels is because it's just, just this entire set, like, I feel whole, and then, like, comics, if I just pick up a random comic, it's not long enough. And then if I have to follow it, it's still, I have to wait for the next one. Or if they're older, I had to find all the other ones. Ugh. So, but I did, uh, I don't know if I showed anyone, but I, the only other comics that I bought were um, the Willow ones. And it's complete. I have all of them. Um, there weren't very many. There were three. And so I haven't read them yet. But if I do, I'll have the complete story and I'll have to worry about it. Um... Okay, and then the box. I don't really feel like figuring out the box this time. Um, just to show you how cute. I'm really tired. Like this is this is after I went to the um, Christmas um, gathering. Technically Christmas Eve gathering, but by the time this uploads, it's probably going to be Christmas. So I said Merry Christmas. Um, Where's the book? I'm going to go through the book real quick because I want to give you guys the actual description of the things that I showed you because some of these I just was going off of what I was guessing they were or, you know, stuff like that. First impressions kind of a thing. Let's see. Is this the page? Sorry, I hate when pages stick together. I can never figure it out. So yeah, the first thing it says is a Captain America air freshener. In a way, I'm kind of glad that they're all Captain America because I hate when they do like, oh, everybody gets a random, you know, character and then you end up getting like a character that you didn't like. Like the first loot crate I got, you know, you could get a different alien character or creature or whatever and... I wanted Ripley or the alien and I ended up getting a character that I didn't want. I'm like, okay, I hate that. Like there's people out there getting characters that I would want and I got a character I won't, don't want. So I don't know. I don't like Captain America. I already said that. So I'd be pissed if somebody else got a character that I did like, cause I'd be like, well, I want that one. Anyway. Um, next is the exclusive dancing group crew socks and since I don't feel like opening up the package, I'll just show you what it looks like on the model. And the I am Groot goes on the foot, and the little Groot goes around the ankle. My ankles aren't too big, so I'm hoping that Groot looks fine. It's when it gets, like, when the socks are higher around my calves, that's when the sock starts distorting pretty bad. <laughs> and then the Tetris sticker set. And then, which were pretty self-explanatory. And then the exclusive Ghostbusters door hanger. I honestly, 
I mean, I was aware that it went on the door, but, like, I didn't know what the proper term is, and then it ends up being called a door hanger. Where is it? Where did I put that? <coughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm coughing because I'm sick, but, um, yeah, so, it's just a door hanger. Oh, it looks like other people get different ones. So, the one on the booklet is different from the one I got. I just have this side and this side. And so, I guess you could get different ones. And then the next one was the, I'm throwing things, so if you hear that, that's me throwing things. The next is the Sim Simpsons cast wallet. Um, yeah, there's nothing really about this wallet that I haven't shared with you guys because the information came inside the wallet itself. Um, and then here is the exclusive, the Joker, Batman, Batman, Pop, Final, final Figure. <laughs> um, and the description is, Bet you didn't know that Batman likes to cosplay as his wicked arch nemesis in his spare time. This brand new Funko Pop vinyl figure is Loot Crate exclusive created just for you. Donning the Joker's signature purple and green getup and diabolical grin, it's sure to become a fan favorite collectible. So it's just Batman dressing up as the Joker, but in his, you know, little Batman suit. <laughs> I thought that was a little redundant. Anyways, and then the exclusive Batman comic book, issue 36. And then... Blah, 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 blah. So, yeah. There's all that, all that good stuff. Um, as well as, you know, the occasional free trial stuff that you get and other... Um, coupons and stuff. So, <coughs> sorry, forgive me. Um, I should wrap this video up because I take forever and I know it. I'm sorry, but, um, anyway, that was my loot crate and it's exciting. I think this one, especially, I feel like since, especially it's like, since it's December and you get it around Christmas time, you should feel like you're getting stuff that you would want, like a Christmas present. And, you know, you got your collectible, you got a wearable item, just a bunch of other fun stuff that people would like. Like, stickers are fun. Like, they're just fun. I love stickers. I honestly don't know what I would do with the Tetris ones, but I think it's a fun thing to have. Um, I always get excited with stickers myself. Um... So, uh, I felt like this loot crate was not as disappointing, but I still feel like as a subscription service, it's not consistently pleasing enough for me to continue it any longer. So, I don't think I will be. If you guys know of other subscription services, let me know. And um, I feel like for the most part, for the price that I've paid, I've gotten... For the most part, I feel like I've gotten my money's worth, so I won't complain about that. But I just feel like the items themselves are not personally to my liking for me to get it every month. Um, it's just not consistently pleasing enough for me. So that's that. Um, let me get off of this before I hit the 20-minute mark because I'm about to... And um, I'll see you in future videos. Thank you for your time. Bye.